All right, it is getting crisp out and it's time to think about getting our ice fishing electronics ready for the upcoming ice fishing season. Now, if you follow my channel, you know I'm an avid user of the Hummingbird Helix series uh, in open water, but also when I'm ice fishing. And I have a series of videos on converting your Helix 5s and 7s for uh, fishing on hard water. Now, this is the older Hummingbird Helix ice conversion kit that works for the five and seven inch it came in this uh nylon bag uh that was pretty decent it had a mounting point for your fish finder and a little circle here that you could set your transducer in that locked down in there like that and then you had access to the back for mounting a battery system and you could access your battery, charge it there. A little bit of a handle here that's actually built into the fabric and a couple little soft-sided uh, carrying webbings on the side here. It was great. Um, nothing to write home about, but it did its job to help protect the fish finder. But like I said, it was only limited to size fives and sevens. Um, if you have bigger screens, like a lot of anglers are using on their power boats, uh, you didn't really have any options, but now that's changed. This is the new Hummingbird Helix ice conversion kit for sevens, eights, nines, and tens. Um, now the screen cover doesn't come standard, but I definitely recommend it because there's no fabric case over this shuttle system, but I don't think it's really necessary. And because they've ditched that uh, soft sided bag, there's a lot more opportunities to attach accessories and I'll get into that more. Um, so you can just pick up one of these covers. Um, this one's a nice silicone one, so it doesn't get brittle in the cold weather and uh, it will last a long time, a lot more than I think a plastic one would. So I really like these, they're only like 30 bucks. I'll put links to all these below. So check out how clean this shuttle system is. It has a cup that you can put your ice transducer in and then this ice conversion kit, which retails for about $400, although I've seen it as cheap as $320 already this season, um, it comes with the XI9-1521 Chirp Ice Transducer. And you can actually have the option to mount this cup anywhere here. There's actually 20 standard screw attachment points all over this uh, shuttle system. So you can attach all kinds of accessories that you want. That includes moving the transducer cup, but start thinking about other things, camera systems. Um, you can put glow cups, you can put uh, transducer arms, you can do whatever you want. These are just these standard uh, screw mounts like you would use on the bottom of a camera. So for me, like one example would be easy to do is I use a lot of products with the Ram ball mount system. So here I can thread in this ball and then I can attach my X grip here, which is easy to do. And now I have some place I can attach my smartphone. So if I want to have a chat with somebody or take photos or something like that, I can do all of that using my X grip. It's going to hold it on here again, pretty unique that they've given you all these opportunities to attach whatever you want to this shuttle system. And like I said, think about all the opportunities that you can do that. Even more amazing with this is you can see how clean this whole integration uh, where the battery compartment is and the wiring system is here. If you take this off, it's nice and clean. They have two different uh, insert sizes in there for the battery. So you can run a higher amperage uh, 12 volt battery or even look at a higher voltage battery if you're interested in doing that. There's an on off switch in here so you can connect the and disconnect the battery source. So what's even more cool about this is they've included three SAE connectors in here, right? So now you can make your own power source connections to whatever you're running, your accessories, wh whether that be a glow cup, uh, a camera, if you wanna put a USB connection to uh, your phone, you can do that too. They've just given you this option to run more accessories off of your battery pre-wired. You don't have to worry about adding additional wiring. It's already done for you, which is great. And because of how nice this whole system is, how clean it is on the inside, They've even got a 
underneath here, which I'll zoom in here for you. They've got a little system to allow the wires to be easily fed out the front if you want to do that and manage for cable management. It's going to make it a lot cleaner. And you can also pull more wires in uh, if you want less movement on those on the bottom of this wire cable management system. So they've really done a remarkable job with that. And those cable management access points aren't just restricted to the front. They've also put them here on the sides as well, on both sides. So you can really run short cables to your accessories that you're mounting on any part of this system. Uh, they didn't put anything here on the top, obviously, so you still will keep it clean for handling and carrying it, which is really nice. It comes with, uh, when you buy the kit, it comes with specific bracket sizes for the seven inch, eight inch, nine inch, and 10 inch screens. Um, so you'll be able to appropriately lock it in here. It's very easy to adjust uh, just like you would on the water by releasing those and rotating that screen to the right angle for you. And then finally, they've attached two rod holders that come with it. So you can mount uh, your rods on the side here. It makes it very easy for you to some ducks just died behind my house. Um, it makes it very easy for you to attach your rods and carry a couple ice rods with you. Basically, it's just a nice, clean, single unit that you can carry almost everything you need on here. I'm gonna be adding a glow cups. I'm gonna be adding a bait puck. So I can carry my bait, carry my rod, everything in here. Maybe just take a small tackle kit. I'm gonna have everything I need built right into this. It's a very cool system. I've already been using it out on the hard water and I'm super pleased with this redesign. I'll put links to this kit below. They're very hard to come by. Um, I've been finding mine on Bass Pro Shops and a few other places, but as the supply chain starts to recover from COVID, we should start seeing more of these and they're definitely a great investment. All right, if you guys have any questions, just let me know in the comments section below and I'll see you next time out on the water or in the backyard. See you later. Bye.